around the lake. Could you pick up a car for me? A Buick Grand National. They wanted to see how fast it can go with a real driver behind the wheel. You know any? Wow, the dad joke energy is real today. Drop me a pin. Sure. A pin. Right. Send me the location. On it. And I'm pretty excited. The regal from hell. Classic 80s muscle. My pop's dream car. He called it the Corvette Killer. No. So you better make him proud. No pressure. Delivered safe and sound. Now that's how you drive. Customer so impressed, he said he would follow us on Insta. Do we have an Insta? Is that a coffee machine? Didn't test that one up. Where? In the kitchen? No, 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 no. It's a social media account. Oh, right. That at Mr. Ride thing. Hold on. Look at him. There's a video of a dog skateboarding and people eating dumplings out of expensive sneakers. Look at I figured it out. No, she... Wait, hold on. She saw a dog skateboarding? Not the point I was making. Later, kid. Hey, kid, I got a Lamborghini Aventador. Belongs to a buddy of mine, and he wants to see what this supercar's got. Woo, that's a sweet ride. Your buddy's not messing around. Send me the deets. Done. Parker the Third. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Simon. Deb. Oh, no, thank you. Not with my cholesterol.
All right. Aventador's right where it should be. And faster than I could have done it. It's nice to be getting back to work again after, well, you know, customers coming back, and you're a big part of it. It's the least I can do. Hey, the past is a pass. Deep. You should print that on some t-shirts. And give them away free with all changes. Hmm. Huh. Later. I got an ultimate merc for you to deliver. You free? Woo! The Mercedes AMG GT? Am I right? Of course I'm right. You got it. And another chance to show the lake what this garage is all about. Hit me up with the location and I'll start turning some heads. Done. Oh, and don't forget I'm ordering in tonight. Hey, I dropped the Mercedes off. Yeah, customer was stoked. Great work deserves great food. So deep dish your noodles. Oh, maybe that new place, Balama Ramen? Holden Parker III's place? You know what they serve there, right? Rich, spicy noodles and hearty miso broth? All topped off with low-fat, high-protein oh. choice cuts of llama. Oh, right. Maybe not then. Later, kid. OK. OK. Bye, Rydell. Hey, if the mayor keeps cracking down, we might need some more ways to earn cash. Look, I told you before, no one is going to pay to watch Garage Cam. We have a Garage Cam? Am I on it? No, I mean, never mind. You got a job for me? I got a Mazda RX-7 that needs delivery. Sending you a pen now.
Mazda dropped off. Gotta say, I was sad to see it go. Already? Drive like that in the Grand and the car is yours. Hey, don't jinx it. No, nah, you're good. <laughs> you're even impressing Tess and she's, well, you know, a lot. She most definitely is. Oh, the idea you had earlier about more publicity for the garage? What idea? Hmm, mm -hmm. maybe there's something in that garage, Cam. Me under the hood, lube in a, a... For the love of Mike, stop. I wonder if HotRods.com is taken. Do not Google that. Hey, kid, if you need a little extra cash before the big race, I got a Ferrari 488 that needs a good run. Ooh, sweet ride. And the cash is the cherry. Bella, Bella. You speak Italian you now? Fancy. Nah, heard it on a pizza ad. Send in the details now. Ferrari delivered, boss. Yeah, the customer was over the moon. Do you have a minute to talk? Sounds ominous. No, I mean... Talk like Tess about you and your ass got me thinking. About what? I've had a lot of sleepless nights over what happened. What I said, what Yaz said. Yeah, it was pretty brutal. Not you, I, I mean just everything. Yeah, I wasn't kind to her. And that's something I have to live with. But I'm glad I still have you. Always. Well, as long as you keep sending me these jobs. Car upgrades don't pay for themselves. Ha! I always knew you had a mercenary streak. Later. Got something for you. Is it a pony? Oh my god, please tell me you bought me a pony. I mean, it got some horses under the hood. Nissan Sylvia. You up for it? Ooh, a chance to perfect my drift. Drop me the pin.
Happy customer? Check. Happy Nissan? Check. Happier Rydell? Check, check. Have I told you lately what a fantastic job you're doing? I am, right? Hey, do we have an employee of the month? Like rewards and stuff? Yeah. You don't have to clear the possum trash for a week. Gee, thanks, boss. Peace. Hey, hey, I got another job for you. Range Rover Sport. Nice. I've always wanted to race through some storm drains. Send me the details. Time to off-road, kid. Range Rover delivered. Your number one employee did it again. My only employee. You're so damn fast, you're leaving those fools in the dust. Yeah, I tried getting into the Burger Academy, but failed the written test. <sighs> now you got me craving a bacon double cheeseburger. Later. All right, mighty. I got a nice little number that needs dropping off straight away. What is happening right now? Fancy grabbing your wellies and putting a mini countryman through its paces. Oh, I see. You're attempting British. Ta, old bean. Doodle pip. Uncanny. Like the queen just called. Ride is with the customer. Yep, they call. Spectacular driving. They were really impressed. So is that all you got for me? No social media fails or snack requests? Hey, I'm not that predictable. So you don't want me to swing past pizza by Alfredo and grab you a pie? Hawaiian. But don't put no pineapple on it now. Hold the pineapple. Never change, Rydell. 
Yo, what up? It's Rocky. Uh, uh, hey. Wow. Uh, how you doing? All good. Road on the street is you a contender for the grand now. Yeah, I'm working toward it. I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> Yo, I'm dropping you my location. Come pick me up. We go for a spin in the bins and all that. Yeah, head in there now. Hey. Show me what you got. Man, I can't believe this is happening. I ain't gonna lie, it's not every day you're sitting next to ASAP Rocky. I'm pretty nervous. <laughs> People don't get to know that I'm human just like them. I go through struggles just like them. I go through frustrations and everything. As far as my accolades and accomplishments go, it's, it wasn't easy, you know, and uh, like I said, I'm just as normal as everyone else when it comes to that matter. People just assume once you know superstardom that you kind of don't bleed or, you know, or shit or sleep or anything. But uh, for me, it's more so just uh, making it, just showing people that we're all relatable in the same sense that we all are the same in the same sense because... I deal with everyday struggles just like anybody else. Most of the time, a common person only correlates struggle to economic problems or you know financial problems. But everybody has problems, regardless of if it's economical or not. So, yeah. Yeah, man. Right? The car is dope, Rocky. You ever think about racing? Yeah, I thought about it. I had to see what the comp was looking like first, though. You know. And? I see if you live up to the height. Oh, that I can do. But that's funny, because from what I see, it seems like you spend all your time arguing with your former teammate. That don't really sound like a contender to me, dog. Oh, the stuff about the car? Look, it, it's complicated. It's always complicated. Real winners channel that shit, though, and perform when they need to. That ain't gonna be a problem. Yo, use that shit to your advantage, man. Focus up. Get right. I ain't gonna disappoint. Yo, you did that shit. That was mad. Yo, that gold about to look real good on you. <laughs> I did my best, all things considered. Hey. 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 You said that. Huh? Well, sorry, kid. I got another delivery job for you. Lamborghini Countach. Dropping you a pen. OK. Weird.
I delivered the Lamborghini, Rydell. Uh-huh. It all went great. Uh-huh. Okay, what is with you? You did great. Customer was very happy. Sorry I'm a little distracted. Yeah, I can tell. I kind of messed up. Go on. I didn't want to be rude, so I accepted a friend thing. And let me guess. We got hacked? I just clicked on one link she sent. Oh my god, baby panda sneezes. I will fix it when I get back. Thanks, kid. Hey, kid. Got time to squeeze in a job for the garage? Hit me up. Car dropped off, boss. Now you did that. Thanks for keeping the garage a priority through all of this. Yeah, well, it's not just work. It's home. I'm proud of you for doing things the right way. Have I said that before? Uh, uh, uh never. I would have remembered. Dinner's on me tonight. Hey, kid, something weird just happened. Oh, no. Is the possum back? And did he bring his possum friends with him? We got an anonymous tip. Like, uh, meet me in the parking garage and come alone tip-off? There's really nothing sketchy about that, right now. No, oh, more like pick your car up from this abandoned lot and come along. What car? The Chevrolet Bel Air that got 
got stolen. The night Yaz left? Yeah. Can you check it out? Eyes on a racer here. I got the Bel Air. It's definitely ours. Who called you? I don't know. They just said it was a friend who wanted to make things right. It's gotta be yes. Just drop it back here. I got another call from our not-so-anonymous anonymous caller. Let me guess. Another stolen car just magically showed up. I don't ask questions. I just answer the calls. Get me the location. I can try to get it delivered ASAP. Now you be safe out there. I'm sure Alec isn't thrilled that his cars are going missing. I guess now he knows the feeling.
What's the story? Same as the last time. The car looked brand new, tuned up, handled great. Like it never left the garage. Why do you think she's doing this now? If I understood why Yaz does the things she does, we probably could have solved this with a phone call the night this happened. Yeah, that's true. Well, I'm not complaining. See you back at the garage. Hey, kid, you got time to pick up one last car? I got the location from our anonymous friend. No time like the present. Which one? The Aston Martin Vulcan. Seriously? I never thought we'd see that beauty again. Thought it would be long gone to a private collector. Yeah, me too, kid. Me too. Location sent. I'll call you after the drop-off. How we do? Just delivered the Aston. That's the last one, right? Yeah. I never expected her to do this. It really means a lot. I know, Rydell. It doesn't make up for everything, but... But it sure makes it easier to forgive. Now let's finish what we started. Sounds like a plan. Also, kid, I'm proud of you. I'll see you back at the garage. You can count on it. <laughs> 